let's start with the new chapter today the name of the chapter is differential equations it is the last chapter under the topic of calculus in your syllabus so what is a differential equation basically if we know that only then we can proceed over the chapter so let's see the definition of a differential equation an equation containing an independent variable dependent variable and differential coefficients of dependent variable with respect to independent variable is called as a differential equation so let me take this up one by one an equation means there must be an equal to sign in these examples you see there is always an equal to sign okay it contains an independent variable before moving on to these examples let me make it clear to you suppose i have y is equal to 2x plus 5 right now this is y is equal to mx plus c form or if i say that different different values of x will give me different different values of y right so these are the two variables that i am taking into consideration one variable is y the other variable is x now see if i have a function y is equal to f of x now as you can see different values of x will give me different values of y because y is a function of x so here my x is independent variable because it is not dependent upon y its value can be decided and accordingly what will happen accordingly the value of y will be obtained so y is your dependent variable right so x and y being independent and dependent variable in this case respectively now again let's move to the definition part it says it contains independent variable dependent variable and differential coefficients this word is important differential coefficients of dependent with respect to independent so if i say that dependent is y independent is x so differential coefficient is d of y upon dx because differential coefficient of dependent over differential coefficient of independent the other thing the other thing is that these have variable orders that means it is not always dy by dx would be there it can be d2y by dx square d3y by dx cube and also there can be whole square whole cube to that too let's take these examples this is dy by dx is equal to 4x so it contains x as the independent variable and dy by dx is already there that dy by dx is differential coefficient of independent and dependent you see that dependent with respect to independent so this is a differential equation now here d2y upon dx square is equal to 2x again you see that here there is a differential coefficient and you see i told you it is not always that dy by dx can be there other variations are possible too next you see this example d2y upon dx square whole square plus dy by dx whole cube is equal to 0 it is an equation has equal to there are differential coefficients so what is important in a differential equation you may miss the independent variable and something parts like dependent but differential coefficient will always be there right if i say y is equal to 2x there is independent variable there is dependent variable but there is no dy by dx until and unless you differentiate it and then you get like this this is your differential equation right so next example is again dy by dx plus 2xy is equal to x raised to the power 5 so now you understand what is a differential equation but we also need to know in what cases or what would be the scenarios wherein we don't have a differential equation so if you have anything except the definition says that must not be a differential equation i hope that makes sense 